keep together. With a bit of luck, we'll make it to that cave. Person's needing more than a bit of luck. We need a great big eat. I can't get up. It makes me very sick. Are you? We're only harmless travelers hiding from the squirrels. They're trying to kill us. <laughs> I am Martin the Warrior. Any beast who is fool enough, come and meet my challenge. You two had better arm yourselves with anything you can. They're going to charge. Good guy, good. Do not be afeard, Mouse Maid. Those scatterbrained savages try my patience no end. Bulge red. Oh, Squike me! Who oh. do you think you are? Squike me! It was a game! Oh. Then I shall play my game. Oh. Thank you, dear creatures. We jolly well did it! The great escape from Marshank! Yes! Show that Badrang a thing or two! Boo, Badrang, boo! <laughs> hey, food for everybody! Whoa! Dried fruits and maple cream! Nuts preserved in honey? Flans, oh. cakes, trifles, and tarts. I don't see my son. Have you served him food, Brom? Feldor? He was hanging around at the edge of the camp earlier. He's probably doing a lone patrol. I'll find him. And lastly, I'm Rose, originally from Noonvale. Are you Rose? Daughter of Urenvo and Arya? Yes! Do you know my mother and father? I'm a map maker. I made a map of Noonvale many seasons ago. And there I met your parents. Then you could show us how to get there. It would be my pleasure to take you to the other side of the mountain. Wonderful! <sighs> yes! I think it goes right through to the other side of the mountain. Feldo! Huh? Brought you a bit of supper. Thank you. Are you all right? Just been thinking how much time I've wasted cooped up in Badrang's prison. Do you think Martin, Grum, and my sister made it safe ashore? Of course. Rose is with Martin. She's safe as a deep-rooted oak. I wouldn't be surprised if they came marching across those cliffs right now with the Noonvale army. Feldo, those are bad ranks creatures. Looks like they're following our cart tracks. Here, take 
Just follow me. Do exactly as I do. Good. That's the half of it. When Hisk reports, we'll head back out and grab them slaves. Stunny, you lock my gates. No. Uh, uh, Clog! The traitor's taken over me fortress! If we can't get over, we'll have to get under. Follow me. I'll get... Any beast who makes a sound. The marshlands, that's where they're hiding. Where no beast would expect it. <laughs> Except one as clever as me. <laughs> this ground is getting soft. Okay. Shut up, Do you want them to know we're here? Good shot, eh? You just killed him. I mean... Ah, young one. It's called war. You'd best give those to me if you can't use them. There they are! Oops. You've been spotted. Time to make a rapid exit. Quick! Get up! See the mole work dug this tunnel. It's huge. How much further do you think we have to go? I don't know, but my paws are getting numb. It's so cold. Ow! Martin, I don't like this. I'm frightened. All right, Rose. I'll talk to Baldrin. Tell her we'll go back and round the mountain. Baldrin? Your whiskers. <laughs> <sighs> this is the life. <laughs> Thank you, Baldrin. <laughs> Charge! Charge! 
I'm not charging just because you shall charge. Charge! Hmm. Yeah, since when have you been in charge? Sorry, did you just say charge? No, not charge! Charge, as in in charge. Well, can't you tell the difference? <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt. Uh, are we under attack? Yes! No! Not yet. <laughs> I don't think them there shrews knows if them's coming or going. Oh, ho, <laughs> and more! <laughs> Begging pardon! We didn't know you had mole in your Ooh. company. Is there anything we can do for you? Food, water. Well, have you got any soup? <laughs> Grum! We're trying to get to Noonvale. Can you tell us the way? <laughs> tell you, we can take you! And uh, the mole will come with me, of course. <laughs> no, the mole goes with me. The whole going this year, one. Done, Grum. You were very brave tonight, young one. Oh, don't worry. Not every creature can take a life. I was like you once. I wish I still was. You wish you were like me? I once loved peace, too. It's bad rang slavery that made me this way. So what can we do? Stop Badrang from recruiting new slaves. Slaves, did you? Didn't have to. Got some more instead. Come and have a look. <laughs> Pay attention, you horrible lot! You have three simple choices. One is slavery. Two is stay loyal to Clog and get executed. <gasps> Three is swear allegiance to me. <laughs> Pause up if you chose number three. Take him to the prison pit! So, it's come to this. 
being slung in an hole like a worm. You're not going in. Lord Badrang's orders are that you must fill it in, slave. <laughs> By Jove, where have you two jolly well been hiding all night? Ah, this young one's earned himself a medal. Help me defeat a bunch of Bad Rang's horde, following our tracks. But I didn't kill a single creature. Well done, Brom. Best way. So Bad Rang's sending troops out after us, eh? He won't give up. And neither will I. I want to train the new recruits so we can attack Marshank. Do you think that's wise? We're all free now. But we won't be as long as Bad Rang rules. He must be stopped. Right you are, old thing. We can call ourselves the Fur and Freedom Fighters. Eh, what? Being a warrior isn't quite as glamorous as I thought it was. War is a hideous beast. There is much suffering and pain. Some creatures use it for their own advantage. I like that scoundrel Budrang. Aye, that's right. right. They call themselves rulers and ignore the laws of the peaceful woodlanders. They gain respect from none but those that are misled. It's up to us to stop Badrang's cruel reign. No other beast will. And if it takes war to crush him, so be it. Full force to the Fur and Freedom Fighters! The Fur and Freedom Fighters! You seem to know this river like the back of your paw. To tell the truth, we've never come this far south. Oh. I hope that's your stomach rumbling, Grum. Oh, I'm hungry, all right. It take my tummy a grumbling. It's a waterfall! Ah! 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 Follow me! <gasps> Baldred! Freedom fighters are ready to take on Marshank. Feldo, you haven't got a tenth of the force that Badrang commands. Too many lives could be lost. I'm not talking about a pitched battle, Father. Lightning attacks are what I want. Hit hard and fast, then vanish, eh? That's the ticket. I agree with Bark John. We're not warriors, and Badrang's horde are. But we are smarter. Brome walked right into Bad Bottom's fort and bluffed his way out again. What do you say, eh, Brome, old fella? I'm not a warrior. I may be good at bluffing, but I don't want to see creatures killed, especially our own. Why can't we just leave here and find somewhere else nice to live? Forget about Badrang. Because Badrang will capture other creatures and make them slaves. We must fight to let our young ones grow up to be free. Well said. We know what it's like under the whips of a tyrant. It's not life, it's living death. We definitely wouldn't have made it if we had gone over. Oh, I can still hear it rumbling, though. Only this time, I think it really is my tummy. <laughs> Who's to say it isn't another waterfall up ahead? Me! <laughs> you see those knotty old willows? I sat under them when I was a little one. You know where we are? Yes! We're nearly there! We're nearly home in Noonvale! <laughs> 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 
Non è vero! Non è vero!